Hello, welcome to Smatbot. In this video, we will see how to set up MetaCloud API. Go to developers.facebook.com and select My Apps. Click on Create App and choose an app type. Dot. Provide the display name and choose the business account for which the app should be connected. Once done, click on Create App and enter your password. Once the home page gets displayed, click on WhatsApp Setup button. In WhatsApp, getting started, click on Add Phone Number. Next, create a WhatsApp business profile with display name time, category, and click on Next. Add phone number and click on Next to get a verification code. Once the verification code is added, jump to Step 2 and click on Send Message. Now, check your WhatsApp. You should have received a message from Meta. Next, copy phone number ID, WhatsApp business account ID, and save these details. Next, click on Configuration, and edit the fields. Add your callback URL and verify token and then verify. Now, click on Manage, add the 15.0 version, and subscribe to all the webhook fields. Go to Business Settings. In Users, click on Generate New Token and then click on the FB page. Next choose Business, Catalog and WhatsApp Management Fields. You can also add Instagram Management Fields. Once done, generate a token. Next copy the token generated and save it for future use. Next, go to Accounts, WhatsApp Accounts and click on Settings then on WhatsApp Manager. In WhatsApp Manager Dashboard, go to Account Tools and click on Message Templates, and then select Namespace. Save these details. Next, go to smapit.com and log in with your user credentials. Click on the bot for which you wish to configure Cloud API. Create your bot flow and flow setup. Navigate to the install section and then click on WhatsApp installation. Now, add a new WhatsApp account. Select Meta as your WhatsApp provider. Choose your WhatsApp name and enter your number given in Meta API. To get the product token number, copy the temporary access token that can be found in developers.facebook.com. For namespace, copy it from the message template in WhatsApp Manager. Add both phone number ID and WhatsApp business account ID in the respective fields. Once done click on save. Congratulations, you have successfully configured WhatsApp API Cloud.